Hey, what's up guys? Welcome back to another OHD SDK tutorial video. And in this one, I'm going to quickly show you guys how you can create a mod out of the SDK. So, I do want to note that I have made a similar video like this before called how to create a content folder for your mod. But you no longer have to do it that way since they've added um, a way officially to create a mod um, like this you guys will see these two buttons here and so in that video before you had to go to edit plugins and then create a new plugin and then the basically you use the plugins content folder to put all of your mod stuff inside of but that's no longer the case so all you need to do is click click on create mod and then once you've done that uh, it will open up like this so it's a very a very similar um ui than when you if you were to like go create a plugin um and so all you need to do is just add in your mod name so that could be anything you like so all i'm gonna do is just call it tutorial mod tutorial mod like so and then what i'm gonna do next is add in the author my name like so so this is basically the name of whoever is the owner of the mod and then if you want to you can add a description in here and then these other things here you can leave as is and then you can leave these checked and all you do now is click on create mod and then it will automatically open the mod data asset for you so this is basically where if you um want to add new folders um this is basically where you specify where those specific components are like the game modes goes into the core folder and then factions into the factions directory and then maps um it's just like a maps folder so you would have to create these three folders by default um and, and unless you want to call it something else you just specify it here and then if you click on the plus icon here you can see you can add more uh, things here and so um here you can specify the your platoon folder guessing that's where everything goes for platoons and then your rule sets as well and so by default you wouldn't have to worry about adding any new ones here just yet but if you want to you can and so once I close that, you see it automatically put us in our tutorial mode here. And so you're ready to go. Um, you can start making your mod and everything. And so, uh, yeah, that's going to do it for this video. If you guys enjoyed it, make sure you guys give the video a thumbs up. And also remember to subscribe. If you're not subscribed yet, I'll see you guys in the next one.